Welcome back to Space Engineers, folks. I have figured out what was wrong, and I am so happy. Now, if we look at this little weird ship that I built, I only built it to figure out what the heck was wrong with the big old ship down there. Now, you can see here, we have the engines running, and they will hurt me if I'm in front of them, I believe. Uh, maybe not. Uh, but this little ship flies just fine. If we unlock here, it flies 100% perfect. Fantastic. And only on hydro thrusters. So um, let, let me turn the thrusters off. So there. That works. That works. Now, before, when I was trying, I was wondering why the heck isn't the little uh, thrust thingy showing so that you can see that it's on. And that was because all of the tanks here, all the hydrogen tanks, they were on stockpile, uh, which they also are also all are now. So if we go in here, turn on our hydro thrusters. Now, there's no glow. If we go back, and take the tanks off stockpile, now, there's a glow, and it's working. Yay! So, that was the problem. So we're actually ready to go to space now. Uh, I did... Uh, I took off these ugly uh, thrusters I put on the sides. Because they actually aren't needed. Because if we go in here... And try out uh, unlocking, we can actually go up with these four hydrogen thrusters. We won't hover. We'll slowly go down again, but that's fine. So we're, we're ready to go, except uh, there is one last thing that we need to do that I had forgotten. Uh, I want to just... Whoa, 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 whoa. I want to turn those on stockpile so that we're not spending our ice or our, our hyd hydrogen. So, because we're going to leave this uh, attachment here, the... Atmo attachment hanging out in space. Let's go check out these uh, radars. So it's going to need some fuel. Well, it's going to need some power, not fuel. And we're going to give it that by giving it some solar panels on each side. so that it can charge its batteries. What was that? Still there? Potassium. Fine. Uh, so yeah, that's what we're gonna do. Nothing in here looks like. Just check out these over here as well. Nothing in here. There are a lot of craters out here. Uh, here's something. What is that? Carbon. Okay. Looks like this one, and then we'll hit the others on the way back. Hey, hey, hey. Come here. So, yeah. And I really want to say thank you, everyone, for all your uh, comments and suggestions. It is very much appreciated that uh, you took an interest. And uh, thanks for, for, for telling me about the ion thrusters not being useful on a planet, because I might have spent a lot of time, wasted a lot of time, uh, trying out iron thrusters on a planet, and that would have sucked. 
So yeah, thank you so much for all the information you, you gave me. Mm, here's some more iron. Where did it go? Where? And what do we have here? Maybe silver, maybe potassium. Potassium. Okay, this is the last one we'll hit, I think. Uh, we might as well check, right? Nothing. Nothing. There's some carbon in here. Not that I know what I need carbon ore for, but it's fine. Alrighty. So let's just quickly build some uh, solar panels on the, the lifter ship, and then we'll get going. All right. So what do we need for that? Uh, we need, first of all, we need solar panels. Uh, solar panels, let's put them there. I guess we'll stick them here. Not like that, like that, not like that, like that. We need steel plate. Alright. Uh, steel plate. We'll put two on each side, I think. Those are the wrong way around. Never mind. All right. Those were supposed to be stopping thrusters. Ah, never mind. Never mind. Uh, let's get the stuff that we need for this thing. I'm sure we don't have everything in here, but we have some of it. wonder if we even have any solar cells ready-made for this. Just quickly head up here and pick up some stuff. It should only be one run, I think. So yeah, we are heading to space today. I am so happy. I am so happy. We need to make some solar cells. Make 200. Could be enough. Um, we are getting close. 32 solar cells more. 13 more. All the components were successfully withdrawn. Nice. Alrighty, let's load you all up. There we go. And we're ready to go. Uh, let's let me just check. Um, we have some food, I think. Didn't I bring all the food? 
Uh, thought I did. I guess not. So that's something that I need to go get. And maybe some water as well. Uh, how much ammo do we have? We have enough. Enough. Alright, so let's see. Synth. We don't have any synth food. Uh, water. Uh, we don't have any water either. Oh, yeah, we have H2O there and synth food there. Alright. Good, good. Let's just grab, uh, not all of it. Just take 10 and 10. All right, in that case, uh, we're ready to go. Uh, let's save, just in case. Because after all this trouble, losing the ship now would just break my heart. So we will turn these bad boys on, we'll turn the, those on, and we'll turn those on, and we're off. We are off, guys! So now we're going up on Atmo Thrusters. There's no point in wasting hydrogen. Ready. Two point five. I am so happy this worked, man. I was really, really distraught that we'd spent all this time building a ship and it didn't work. So, all right, we're at the point where we need our hydro thrusters. Oh, I need to close my helmet. I forgot to close up the ship. All right, we're up to 6.5 kilometers. And planetary gravity is going down. Uh, let's turn off our inertia dampeners. No point in fi fighting those. We can turn off the Atmo engines now. Save on power. All right, we're at almost at 10 kilometers now, guys. 10 kilometers. Gravity is down to 6.4 or 0 0.62, 061, 11 kilometers. We're going into space. I am so happy. Still have 77% H2O, so that's good. We're down to half gravity. And if we go out here and take a look. Ooh, look at that. We can actually see the planet's curvature. We're up to f almost 15 kilometers now. <laughs> this makes me so happy. And we can actually close the inner doors to make the area airtight. I don't know if we'll have any oxygen in here just because we make it airtight, but we'll try. Let's see. Seems like it because I am not taking damage from this. Yes, I am. So, definitely not take off our helmet yet. I need to figure out how this uh, ACMO system works or the O2 system works. All right, we are up to 20 kilometers, 0.25 gravity. Hmm. 
<laughs> We're going to space. Zero point two two gravity. One point two one to twenty two kilometers. Man, this is awesome. This is so cool. Don't look around. Wow, look at that planet. Look at that sun over there, man. This is so awesome. Let's just go up. Look at that. Look at that. I love it. Oh. That is gorgeous. Isn't that gorgeous? I freaking love it. So let's jump in and have a look. How high are we? We are down at 0 0.12 gravity. Oh, there's an asteroid. Look at that. Oh, hope we don't run into any asteroids. We'll look at asteroids when we're out of the planetary gravity. I am so happy. We still have 71% H2O, so all good. 0 0.1 gravity. Zero point zero nine. We're almost there. Almost there. Wait, where does gravity end, I wonder? 40 kilometers or something? Everyone's all right. Mm. Almost, guys. Almost. Seven. This is so exciting. Let's just see. Are we going to fly into every... Yeah, we might. We might hit an asteroid if we don't watch out. So let's watch out. Uh, there's six. Almost in space. Let's, let's go backwards a little bit because that asteroid is scaring me. Zero six, zero five. We are basically out of gravity. There is no gravity. We are out of gravity. <laughs> Man, this is cool. Well, let's uh, turn our inertial dampeners on, I think. Let's try and, and head to uh, an asteroid. No enemies so far. Still have 68%. Um, seven. All right. Right now, the moon is our destination. Freaking love it. We're in space. We are in space. Look at that big asteroid right there. Wonder if there are any useful ores on it. 
Let's, uh, I think, um, uh, or Hector. Which one is it though? Uh, or so this one. We'll call this large or detector. And it is on, so let's see if we look at it again. Or detector has a range of 150 meters. I guess we're not close enough to see if there's anything. Well, if there is anything, who knows? There isn't necessarily anything on here. Oh, there is something. Silver. Silver. We'll take some silver. But we'll do it in our little mining ship. Isn't this cool? This is so cool. Uh, well... Well, I guess the first thing we should do is let's. Okay, we do take damage, so you know what? we might as well turn these off and put these on stockpile. Um, okay, so the hangar doors are closed. What about. You say. Uh, vent. Mm. Pressurize off. What's that? Oh. So, which air went? Which air vent is which? I wish we could see that. Mm. Okay, we will say vent. Actually, let's say oxygen tank. They're on stockpile. Off. Oh, here we go. Uh, let's go heal up before we buy this out. Mm. Okay. There we go. My helmet off. And we're good. We are not taking damage. So what we could do is close that door. Um, we say vent. Oh, we need to. So we have two air vents in here. So if we go in here and say vent, depressurize on. Now we're taking damage. So if we say uh, vent and say off, room pressure, we're getting some pressure. Uh, How much health am I down to? Let's put this on real quick. Um, vent. Okay, so this one is... 
Okay, so it has to be this one as well. We say off here. Then this room is fine. Okay, so if we go back to the control panel and say vent, we'll say cockpit air vent one, and then it was this one. Cockpit air vent. Ah. Air vent two. Okay, so that's those two. Now if I want To figure this out for the room downstairs. Can I do that? Suppose I can. I go in here. Uh, control panel, air vent. So. guess it's these two so we turn this off and this off and then take our helmet off it's holding so there uh, right vent instead that's gonna be easier so it's these two This is living quarters air vent one, and this is living quarters air vent two, which means that this is hanger air vent one. And this is hanger area two. All right. So I don't actually want any of them on the pressurized, but okay. Now. Guess it's time to go mine some silver, but we are gonna do that in the next episode, guys, because I think we're out of time. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time in space. Yay!